Oh, the blast signal. Take cover! Imminent blast! I would have earned the one, but I guess the 63 will have to do. Goal! I have to talk to her. She's got to know who her savior is. Rufus, do you have to snoop around here? Hi, Inspector Gizmo. That's Dr. Gizmo. As you know, I hold all three positions in this emergency station. And right now, I'm a doctor. And as a doctor, I have the right to ask, why are you bothering my patient? She's an acquaintance of mine. I wanted to see how she's doing. Her name is Gold. So, <laughs> the Elysian is an acquaintance of yours, eh? Very funny. Well, as long as your lacking sense of reality doesn't keep me from doing my job... Knock yourself out. Look after your acquaintance, but make it snappy. What? Come on! Enough daydreaming for today. My patient needs rest. Well, at least I guess that she needs rest. In order to know for sure, she would have to wake up first. She's unconscious. What's wrong with her? What does she need? To be more conscious, obviously. For further tests, she would have to be awake. Unfortunately, none of my remedies seem to work. Well, how about some really strong coffee? Ha! <laughs> The coffee that can be of help here needs to be brewed. Doesn't every coffee need to be brewed? Yes, right, but... Hey, not to worry, Dr. Gizmo. I have a plan. Do the world a favor and spare us your plans, Rufus. Your wacky plans have never done anyone any good. Except that the mayor granted me a larger file cabinet for patients' histories. Dr. Gizmo? What now? Will she fully recover? She'd need to wake up first to be able to tell. Well, why don't you wake her up then? Well, it's not that easy. I've already tried every stimulant I could find in my medicine cabinet. None of those were strong enough. She needs something much, much stronger. Something much, much stronger. Hmm. Sounds like a job for me. I am much, much stronger after all. I will save her. Ha! Good luck. Did you bring some kind of miracle stimulant by any chance? Something that might wake her up? A kind of cup of coffee to the nth order? I'm working on it. Good, but do it someplace else. What are you waiting for? Help her! I would love to, but self-professed acquaintances of the patient are constantly interrupting me in my efforts. <laughs> Self-professed acquaintances. That sounds funny. <laughs> Self-professed acquaintances. <laughs> Think you can say that a thousand times in a row? <laughs> Why should I? I could even say get lost a thousand times in a row and you wouldn't get it. I want to report an emergency. An emergency? What is it? Fire! Impossible. My fire protection sensors would already have detected the emergency. You have built-in fire protection sensors? Yes, ever since you turned eight years old, you little brat. That was my last birthday with my dad. I got a cake. I think I even remember the fireworks. I remember them too. Incredible how much you achieved with just eight candles. Robbery! Impossible. My theft protection sensors would already have detected the emergency. You have built-in theft protection sensors? 
All emergency prevention tasks are united in one person, and that's me, as you very well know. A small village like Kuvac is just not big enough to have a doctor's practice, a fire department, and a police station separately. Or at least, that's what I thought. Ever since you turned eight, I'm not so sure about that anymore. No emergency. My bad. If you say so, it sounds too good to be true. Do you have a stimulant for me? To make you even more annoying? I don't think so. I've used up most of the stimulants on the patient, but to no avail. I still have some left in the medicine cabinet in my office, but no one except me is allowed to access it. We'll see about that. What was that? Uh, time for me to leave. That's what I keep telling you. What can I do to wake her up again? Nothing, unless you had a miracle stimulant to wake her up. Well, thanks for your time. You're welcome. Hmm, not literally. I thought you are on your way to Elysium. Have you come back to pay your tab? Oh, that. Oh, well, listen, Lonzo. I, uh, I planned to do that, but constructing an escape vehicle costs a lot. And, uh... <laughs> Don't worry, Rufus. No one here expected you to make it. Huh. Ah. Great. Thanks, I guess. Lonzo. Yeah? Long time no see, Lonzo. Long time indeed. Anything new? Hey, you know how Kovac is. Nothing ever happens in Kovac. Yep, without me, this place would be dead. Well, without you, there would be fewer explosions, I know that much. It must be pretty sad for all of you that I'll be gone soon. It's almost unbearable. Almost. How about a shot of that old worry be gone? Well, that depends. Will you ever pay me what you owe? Of course. I just need to get some money first. But you know that I'm always true to my word. <laughs> If you find a new word that makes you look less like a frog. Well said, Lonzo. Well said. Did you hear about the stranger? The girl? Yes, but I don't care. Don't tell me you want to start quarreling about her with all the other idiots. Well, you know me. <laughs> I'm always the first in line when... Uh... Idiots are quarreling. Yes. Tony really gets on my nerves. Well... That's your version. Wait, did she come here too? Someone had to pay for the table you broke yesterday. Yeah, that was an awesome performance, wasn't it? Look at me! I'm Tony! Scold, scold, scold! Wine! Fret, fight, scream! <laughs> yeah, I know. Perfect impression. <laughs> Do 
you have something that can give someone a real boost? Since when are you ordering coffee? Did you break Tony's coffee machine again? How often do I have to tell you that you don't filter oil that way? No, this is not about simple coffee. I need something that really, really makes you wake up. A kind of ultimate pick-me-up. Lonzo, are you okay? Okay, just forget I ever asked. I'm off. No, no, wait a minute. I think I know exactly what you need. Oh, boy. This is it. This is the moment I've been waiting for. Hey. Wow. You have a pipes? Tanks? Valves? It's a... It's a... It's a thing. This is an espresso machine. But this is not just any old espresso machine. This is the mother of all espresso machines. I tuned it myself. And you wound ribbons into its hair? Indeed I did. Okay, but one question remains. What exactly is this espresso? Well, to be honest, I'm not sure myself. I think it's a kind of highly concentrated coffee. The people of prehistoric times drank it. Uh Uh-huh. And then they forgot to switch it off. (laughs) I see. I built the compressor, following all the instructions that I found. Unfortunately, the pictures were pretty blurry, but I think I figured out what ingredients are needed. Take the recipe. It's right next to you on that bar stool. If you bring me these ingredients, we can start brewing. In the meantime, I'll have found my life insurance policy. I hope. Ho, 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 ho! I'm so excited! (laughs) What a scrawl. Okay, I need clear, reviving, and energy-rich water. The coffee powder must be black, stimulating, and made from hot beans. And, hmm, none of these things can be found in Kuvac. Never mind, though. Being a master improviser, I bet I can find plenty of alternatives. Uh, what exactly am I supposed to do? It's all written down on the recipe I gave you. Just bring me everything that's on the list. Till then I'll do some fine tuning on the espresso machine. Okay. About the powder. Tell me. Do you have any idea what kind of blackish powder is needed for this recipe? I have no idea. I don't think they're talking about black powder. Black powder... Hmm. I said it's probably not black powder. But black powder is blackish. Listen, this machine works with high pressure and extreme heat. If you put black powder into the... Yada, yada, yada. Let me worry about the ingredients and you'll prepare the machine. Oh, no. I am starting to regret this. Any idea what highly stimulating means? I have no idea. Maybe some kind of stimulant? Maybe Dr. Gizmo has some in his office. Oh, that reminds me. Maybe Dr. Gizmo has some kind of stimulant in his office. That's just what I said. You did? Maybe I'd listen more carefully if you said something useful from time to time. Ah, I guess I had that coming. Any idea what hot beans are supposed to be? No idea. Well... This seems to be a highly intellectual puzzle for a gifted mind. Right. Maybe you should ask Wenzel. I was talking about me. Sorry. 
I guess I should have known. Statistically, it was very likely that you were talking about yourself. Any idea what hot beans are supposed to be? No idea. Well... Right. Maybe you should ask Wenzel. I was talking about me. So Statistically, it was very likely that you were talking about yourself. Do you have any idea what kind of blackish powder is needed for this recipe? I have no idea. I don't think they're talking about black powder. Black powder... Hmm... I said, it's probably not black powder, but black... Listen! Yada yada yada. Let me worry about the ingredients and you'll prepare the machine. I'm starting to regret this. Don't worry, I'll manage. Hurry up! I can't wait to fire up this sweet machine for a test brew! Uh, about the water. Keep it flowing. Clean water? Where can I get clean water? Clean water is a myth. Everybody knows that. My father always told me that story about how he founded Kuvac on top of a source of fresh, clean spring water. Hogwash! Your father was a bullshitter, just like you. Bullshitter? What's that supposed to mean? Someday, someone will explain it to you in detail, I'm sure. Energy-rich water. What do you think that's supposed to mean? I have no idea. Hanek told me that sometimes. How about you ask him? Oh, sheesh. This whole quest... Exhausting. Hanek is working right in front of this building. Hanek! I guess you'll have to move a few steps into his direction and talk to him directly. Hmm. Exhausting and stressful. The recipe says something about a revitalizing liquid. I don't know what that means. I don't know either. A liquid that makes something inanimate come to life again? That sounds scary. What's scary about that? Just imagine, a freezer making breakfast in bed for you. Yeah, obviously you've never been in a relationship with Tony. Don't worry, I'll manage. Hurry up. I can't wait to fire up this sweet machine for a test brew. This looks pretty... daring. It is. Great, that's what I wanted to hear. You won't believe what happened to me today. Yeah, you're probably right about that. So why don't you keep your story to yourself this time? But it's got everything. Action, drama, romance. Oh, a dragon too. Uh, no. In that case, I'm not interested. Now that you mention it, yes, there really was a dragon. Too late. Damn. Uh, what exactly am I supposed to do? It's all written down on the recipe I gave you. Just bring me everything that's on the list. Till then, I'll do some fine tuning on the espresso machine. Okay. I'll be off then, getting all the ingredients. You do that. I'll be here if you need me. Huh? What was that? Oh, the emergency station has opened again. Oh, that must mean I can choose the more daring options now. Hello? 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 Ah, oh, I'm starving! I've eaten nothing but worms for days now! Ignore him. My wife sometimes talks to herself when she's down there. He must have picked that up from her. We can't meet anymore! Although my husband is almost deaf, his bird has quite good ears. Ah! 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 I'm starving! Ah! Nice parrot. Yes, we use it to detect dangerous fumes in the mine shaft. Oh, what do you do when that happens? We get a new parrot. <laughs> I see.
crap. Locked. <laughs> Gizmo isn't here. That means I can fiddle around with his occupation modes unnoticed. It looked much lighter lying in that cupboard. It's too heavy to lug around. Doesn't matter, though, because I'm always cautious. Strike!
Ah, ah, ah. Brilliant idea, Rufus. What could a lonesome bull crave more than a well-chilled glass of Nat's piss? Okay, I'll use the cow. Main thing is that it worked. Aw, does that upset you? Well, <laughs> an accomplished matador like me knows how to bring the blood of a bull to a boil. Or whatever liquid it is that's pumping through those tubes. <laughs>